Okay, and to start uh, focus on this generic uh, plastic jacket and armor, let's just kind of review the basics of it here. And as, as you can tell, um, and actually maybe maybe the other end of this thing would be better for you, but um, it's it's purely a um, plastic jacket covering interlocking armor underneath it. Um, this sample, of course, doesn't have any uh, conductors or, or cabling inside of it because it's just simply a, a sample of what exactly plastic jacketed cable is. Uh, so anyway, I wanted to touch base real quick and just kind of talk about how this, this plastic is, is really kind of a protection from the elements. Uh, but of course the armor is the is the big deal. That's what keeps the wire from being severed or, or crushed or short-circuited in, in different um, scenarios. The first of which, I guess there's really going to be there's going to be two situations or, or two decisions that are going to lead whether or not you're going to be using uh, armored cable. And, and first would be a, a risk analysis by the end user, designer, and construction team. Uh, and the second would be the uh, any requirements of by code of state and local governing bodies, right? So. Um, you know, the risk analysis would be something like uh, the end user saying this is going to be a, a place with a lot of heavy traffic or with possible future digging and it's critical that we don't have an accident happen where we sever this line or, or cut it, right? So uh, if it's very critical to your process, that's going to be a, a reason why you're going to choose armored cable. The second, of course, is is by code and that would be something like OSHA regulations here in the United States um, with class one div one hazardous locations for example um, and it, they actually require armored cabling um, even if plastic jacketed cables meet crush resistance and impact testing requirements they will still require armored cabling in those scenarios class one div one so uh, anyway, it's going to be one of those two applications that you're going to be using. So.